Hey, I just want to say rest in peace to my brother Will. This guy here, I'm so thankful that y'all didn't finish before I got here. You know what I'm saying? I'm a minority. I'm always late. That's my excuse. It's the truth though. It's like, yo, I don't care. I'm late all the time. So a lot of great things happened as a result of being late. For example, if my dad wasn't late pulling out, I wouldn't even be here right now. <laughs> and if I bomb, I'm good. Because if I bomb, I get 72 virgins. <laughs> the truth, man. So um, I'm, um, I like to tell people I'm like spiritual, not religious. You know what I'm saying? Because certain things just in the Bible doesn't make that much sense to me. For example, like in the Bible it says that the human race started from Adam and Eve, right? Correct? Yeah. You guys read that story? Okay. And in um, science, it says that people actually came from Africa. So I'm like, yo, if sci like science and religion needs to make sense, and I feel like, honestly, if um, you know the Bible was true, white people wouldn't have came from Africa. Uh, sorry, they wouldn't have come from Africa. They would have came from Alabama. You know, because think about it like this, right? Listen to my logic. There was only Adam and Eve in the beginning. They had kids. And in order for the human race to survive, those children had to have kids. So guess what? Yeah. <laughs> What's going on over there? You need to go back. Yes. There we go. All right. So there was a lot of people were talking about how like they're upset that the Little Mermaid is going to be black, right? But I don't think that white people are really mad that the Little Mermaid is going to be black. I think they're just a little bit concerned, right? Because you know, black people don't swim. <laughs> You know, I'm not saying they can't swim, I'm saying they don't swim, you know what I mean? Like, and, and to be honest though, to be fair, like, white people, you guys, you guys started that whole racial mixing shit, okay? Because, look what happened to Michael Jackson. Man started as a black man, ended up a white woman, apparently, I don't know. And then, Jesus. Alright, Jesus was darker in complexion. The Bible even says that. I thought you guys knew how to read. What's going on? Like, seriously. And I got proof that Jesus was black. You know what I'm saying? What the hell is a white man going to be doing in the desert back then? What is he looking for weapons of mass destruction? Or oil? Like, hell no. If he was white, he would have got sunburned. <laughs> but he's Jesus, you could have just healed himself. You know. But why do you think that Jesus walked on water? The black people do not swim. <laughs> Alright, I got definitive proof right here, right? Listen, listen. Jesus performed miracles, defied the laws of physics, and what happened to him? He was sentenced to death on the cross. If he was white, he would have got six months probation. <laughs> All right, so there's some um, common sayings nowadays with uh, younger people. I feel like I'm an old soul. I should have been born a long time ago. I should have been like your age back there. Or, yeah, you got it. No offense. But I feel like I'm one of those people because young people are just, they like to be discreet rather than direct with the things that they're saying, you know? Speaking of discreet. <laughs> yes, brother. Hey, listen, I'm the last one and I got this pretty shirt on, so hold on. My bad, brother. You know I love you. Okay. Nah, bro. You know, I'm sorry. I'm hurt. I'm hurt. I'm hurt. I promise. All right, so, like, young people like to be discreet about things rather than being direct, you know? So, like, not me. I'm just straight up. Like, this is what I want. This is what I'm going to do. So, young people, they got this terminology. It's called, um... Netflix and chill. Y'all ever heard of it? Like, hey, you want to Netflix and chill? Not me. I'd be like, hey, girl, you trying to watch Netflix and then make a sex flicks? Yeah. Can we watch some Hulu and then I'm like, fuck you. <laughs> you know? Peacock and then I'm going to hit you with this. Peacock. <laughs> All right, you know, I'll, oh, 2B and then let me see that side movie. <laughs> 
All right, you know, I see a lot of older women in the audience. I got love for y'all too. Straight up, you know, love the cougars. Girl, can we watch some blockbuster and then I'm hit you with that blockbuster? <laughs> All right, y'all, that's my time. Give it up for your host, Jay Alvarez. Thank you, brother. Nice beer, by the way. Woo. You know what I'm going to that, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Bring my brother Ace. I love you, bro. Man, the system been fucked up to you. It's been fucked up to us, but we got this.